I went on to Amazon Prime. I was like, you know what, let me see if there are any documentaries on Yahweh. So went in the search bar, typed in Yahweh, that came up. Went out and shared it on my platform. That was my night. In terms of the backlash or what people call it, uh, we're in 2022. History is not supposed to be hidden from anybody. And I'm not a divisive person when it comes to religion. I, I embrace all walks of life. You see it on all my platforms. I talk to all races, all cultures, all religions. And my response would be, um, it's not about educating yourself on what Semitism is and what anti-Semitism is. It's really about learning the root words of where these come from and understanding that this is an African heritage that is also belonging to the people. Africa is in it, whether we want to dismiss it or not. So the claims of anti-Semitism and who are the original chosen people of God and we go into these religious conversations and it's a big no-no. I don't live my way like that. I don't live my life that way. Excuse me, I grew up in a melting pot and I say a melting pot of all races, white, black, red, yellow, Jewish, Christian, Muslim, and you can see the way I live my life now. I'm not here to be divisive, so they could push their agenda. I don't want to say they, because I'm not identifying any one group or race of people, but I'm in a unique position to have a level of influence on my community. And what I post does not mean that I support everything that's being said or everything that's being done or I'm campaigning for anything. All I do is post things for my people in my community and those that it's actually going to impact. Anybody else that has criticism and obviously wasn't meant for them. Hopefully I'm understanding what you said and I, I want to make sure I get it right because I don't want to misquote I don't any expect, part of it. I don't expect understanding from a media conglomerate group that sincerely talks about the game of basketball and then we bring up religion as if it's correlative at times when it's convenient for people to bring it up. So please just be direct with your question right. so we can move on from this and I can talk about the game and go home to my son Elohim and my wife Marlene, okay? I might have taken that this was, the, what you shared was not something that you've even watched. This was, you did, okay, you did watch it or either watch it or read it. I had a lot of time last year to read a lot. Read a whole bunch. Good and bad about the truth of our world. So then do you, I guess, understand or not understand those that might imply that that work had anti-Semitic leanings in it? We're I only ask this because the tweet is still up there. So I We're presume. in 2022. It's on Amazon, a public platform. Whether you want to go watch it or not is up to you. There's things being posted every day. I am no different than the next human being, so don't treat me any different. You guys come in here and make up this powerful influence I have over top of the adultery of oh, you. You cannot post that. Why not? Why not? I don't hear uproar of that. I'm not here to be divisive on what's going on on this or that. I'm not comparing Jews to blacks. I'm not comparing white to black. I'm not doing that. That conversation is dismissive and it constantly revolves around the rhetoric of who are the chosen people of God. And I'm not here to argue over a person or a culture or religion on what they believe. No, nah, this is what is here. It's on a public platform. Did I do anything illegal? Okay. Yeah, that's what I'm saying. Did I do anything illegal? Did I hurt anybody? Did I harm anybody? Am I going out and saying that I hate one specific group of people? So out of all the judgment that people got from me posting, I, I just, without talking to me, and then I respect what Joe said, but there has a lot to do with the not ego or pride of how proud I am to be an African heritage, but also to be living as a free black man here in America, knowing the historical complexities for me to get here. So. I'm not going to stand down on anything that I believe in. I'm only going to get stronger because I'm not alone. I have a whole army around me. Kyrie, while we're on the topic of promotion, why did you decide to promote something that Alex Jones said? That was a few weeks ago. I do not stand with Alex Jones' position, narrative, court case that he had with Sandy Hook or any of the kids that felt like they had to relive trauma or parents that had to relive trauma, or to be dismissive to all the lives that were lost during that uh, tragic event. My, my post was a post from Alex Jones that he did in the early 90s or late 90s about secret societies in America of occults, and it's true. So I wasn't identifying with anything of being a, campaigning, a campaignist for Alex Jones or anything. I was just there to post, and it's funny, 
And it's actually hilarious because out of all the things I posted that day, that was the one post that everyone chose to, chose to see. It just goes back to the way our world is and works. I'm not here to complain about it. I just exist. And to follow up on the promotion of the movie and the book. Can you please stop calling it a promotion? What am I promoting? Put it out on your platform. But I'm promoting it? Do you see me doing, do you see By me in front of the, out there, the title? are going to say that you are yeah, I put promoting. it out there just like you put things out there, right? Yeah, but I, okay. I, it's not You put stuff, things out there for a living, right? Right, but my great, stuff is great. not so let's move on. filled let's with anti-Semitic stuff. Let's move on. Don't dehumanize me up here. I, I'm, not, I'm not doing I'm that. You're human free being. to post I can what, post whatever I want, so say what, that and shut it down and move on to the next question. But Kyrie, you have to understand that by I don't have post, to understand anything from you. But, but it's nothing. not me. Nothing. By it's no people that you're making you up, bro. Move on. But by posting move what on, you next question. Next Anybody question. Do you guys have any more questions? And they're going to say, "You guys have any more questions?" Because this is going to be a clip. Beliefs. This is going to be a clip that he's going to marvel at. Is this any more questions? But you're not answering the question. Oh, this is another answering your question. Oh my God! Let's make another Instagram clip so we could be famous again. Next question. Kyrie basketball.